In the early days of online advertising, publishers and advertisers sought ways to efficiently manage their buying and selling needs, which led to the creation of the first ad networks. As more and more websites and apps launched, there needed to be a way to connect millions of advertisers to the billions of publishers with unsold inventory. This led to the creation of ad exchanges. So how exactly do they function? An ad network is an online platform that allows publishers to sell their inventory to advertisers. Think of a supermarket, where shoppers can get all different kinds of goods from a single place. A publisher typically connects to multiple ad networks. For them, ad networks are a way to sell any inventory that does not get sold directly to advertisers. For advertisers, using an ad network allows them to choose from a wide range of publishers and to reach as wide an audience as possible. Ad network is also an efficient way to target specific audiences for different ad campaigns. The ad inventory on it is segmented by categories, allowing advertisers to target specific audiences by age, gender, or location, etc. Ad exchanges act as an online marketplace where publishers, advertisers, agencies, ad networks, DSPs, and SSPs can buy and sell their ad inventory. It works a lot like buying and selling shares on the stock market. By using a technology called real-time bidding, the exchange sells inventory on an impression-by-impression -impression basis, meaning that advertisers have to bid against each other for any specific advert. For publishers, ad exchanges have become an essential way in which they can maximize the value of their remaining inventory. For advertisers, ad exchanges have maximized the value of their ad spend and has revolutionized the way inventory can be bought based on who they're targeted towards. Ad networks and ad exchanges coexist as fundamental parts of today's advertising industry. Nowadays, almost all advertisers use a blend of both to ensure they reach the widest audience.